Here's Larry. He's not looking so spiffy. Oh, speaking oh, of spiffy. You talk about spiffy. Whoa. This is Nadine time. Hey, Nadine. Hi, Larry. Come on in, woman. How you doing? Come on in. Well, yes. Homer's mad at me. Why? I got my backseat driver's license renewed yesterday. <laughs> <laughs> That'll do it. I hear you got a new puppy. Oh, I do. Yeah. Look. Oh, my goodness. See these marks? You. Was that New Louis puppy marks. Dog? No, those, no. That's she, not Louie and that's a dog. No, her bites are bigger. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Bless your heart. Look huh? at there. I mean, they just, little puppies have those sharp teeth. Yeah. Are you trying to nurse your finger or something? What? <laughs> no, just attacking me. We love She's a Atlanta. cute one, oh, I'm telling you. What little, is it? It's a little key sound. Oh. Key absolutely sound. I was trying to think cute. of that. I told Cherokee, I said, some kind of hound. I can't remember what it is. <laughs> Keyshawn. My, my next door neighbor's got a dog that was getting way overweight, mm -hmm. and uh, she took him to the vet, and the vet gave her some diet pills and said, give these to him, and we'll check him. She took him back in two weeks, and he hadn't lost an ounce. She said, or, you know, the vet said, are you having trouble giving him these pills? She says, no, I stick it in his ice cream every night, and he eats it up just like that. <laughs> <laughs> That'll do it. She, she's one of those that she called a vet a couple of years ago, and she said, I'm so upset, said he's, he's eating two bags of unpopped popcorn, and I don't know what to do. What should I do? He said, well, all I can tell you is just keep him out of the sun. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Put him on a low burner. Yeah. We, <laughs> we took the grandkids over to the zoo the other day and, and uh, went in there, and the monkeys, all the monkeys were gone. I said, where are the monkeys? And Homer asked one of the keepers, said, where are they? He said, well, it's mating season. They're all inside right now. And Homer said, do you think they'd come out for some peanuts? And he said, would you? Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. You got to think about that yeah. one. <laughs> yeah. It'll hit you in a minute. But the funniest one was they saw a peacock. They'd never seen a peacock before. And it came out there and that big old tail spread out like that. And they were just, they just were enthralled. They just couldn't believe that. We got home and their daddy came and picked them up. And he says, Daddy, you can't believe what we saw. We saw a Christmas tree come out of a chicken. <laughs> <laughs> so I hadn't thought of it that way. and didn't think of it as a Christmas tree, but that's probably a good. You're right. But uh, they, was, they were at the house and I was walking down the hallway and I looked in my bedroom and my grandson was laying there on the bed and he was reading the Bible to the cat. And I said, well, I was just, you know, you go on, just ignore it. I went on in the kitchen, and I'm cooking. I hear all this commotion in the back. And I go back there, and he has filled the tub up with water. And he's got trying to hold his cat down in there. And I said, what are you doing? He said, I'm baptizing boots. <laughs> and I said, you cannot put a cat in water. They don't like it. He said, well, he shouldn't have joined my church. That's <laughs> right. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> well, I'm going to go and put the sign up. Uh-huh. Don't baptize cats today? Yeah. What's it going to say? It's going to say your greatest test is when you're able to bless someone while you're going through your own storm. That's good. It's true. You That's know who good. we're thinking about. Don't you? Yep. 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 <clears throat> a lot of tragedy in life. There are. But there's a lot of blessings mm -hmm. come out of it. So do. Hey, y'all. Thanks for stopping by. And don't forget to subscribe, like, and ring the bell. <laughs>